to the iDump Classic Pro tutorial and in this tutorial we're going to copy tracks from an iPod to the PC and like the previous um, tutorials this is a very simple process so the first thing we'll do is click PC and here we can have um, well here we have a list of uh, folders um, which we can select as a destination folder for our music so once we do that just go into that folder and now we see here that PC tracks in my music folder is where the destination um, the source tracks are going to be copied to so what we'll do here um, is what I want to do is create um, an artist folder, an album folder and then place the tracks within there and we do this by selecting the output format so these percent %A, percent %B, percent %T and the other percents all represent like the name of the title, the artist, the album, the year etc so what you'll do here is select uh, an appropriate layout for example if I just wanted to copy tracks into the PC tracks folder and I didn't want to create any subfolders then I could just select the output format of percent %t if I wish to convert those to any one of a number of audio formats there's quite a list here uh, so you can select basically anything you want if I do OG for example quality keep it high then on here I'm going to select some tracks and basically perform a copy and it will copy each of those tracks into the destination folder the format will just be track name and it's going to perform a conversion into OG for this I'll pause it now while uh, the while it's in progress. As you can see the, the tracks once they're converted are appearing on the right hand side in that destination folder. Once the uh, conversion completes I'll show you an example of um, copying tracks into artist album folders within the PC tracks destination folder okay uh, what this uh, software will also do is search the internet if it can't find um, the artwork on the, within the iTunes sorry within the uh, iPod database and it will uh, copy that to the destination tracks if it supports the artwork tag within that audio file folder. So what I'll do here now is select artist album track and I'll select some audio there. albums and no conversion it's going to be a straightforward copy straight to the um, destination folder so this will be a little bit quicker than before finished and if you use Explorer or go into here you can see those tracks in that folder and 
that's pretty much it as simple as it gets and uh, so that's the end of this tutorial again anything to you want us to uh, explain more please uh, drop us a line and uh, we'll do more tutorials